Gentlemen, <laughs> welcome to Hong Kong. I made a very spontaneous uh, stop over here on my flight to Vietnam. I have an eight-hour layover, so I thought, uh, just uh, why not heading to the city where I spent two years of my life uh, many years ago as a chef. I really love the city, and it's great to be back. Today is Sunday. And it's a lot of activity and a lot of action here going on, especially uh, many, many Filipina uh, workers who live and work here. They have uh, enjoying their off day today and they are all over the place. They're doing some dancing lessons here or what, I don't know. Um, and yeah, I'm just enjoying a few hours here. And I'm on my way to Vietnam. I will arrive tonight. Today is Sunday, the uh, 27th of October. And I will arrive tonight in Saigon, in Ho Chi Minh City. And then tomorrow I will move on to Nha Trang, which is um, a city north of Saigon in Vietnam, on the coastline. And I'm gonna visit a good friend of mine. He is also a chef. I haven't seen him in a while. And, uh, I think I'm gonna be stationary in Vietnam for a while. Uh, I had a great time during the past three weeks. I have moved from, I visited Kuwait. I moved from Jordan to Kuwait, uh, to Dubai, then to KL, to Kuala Lumpur, to Kota Kinabalu. Then I traveled to Manila where I spent almost a week, so I had a lot of activity, a lot of action and now it's time to, uh, to settle down a little bit, to calm down, you know, uh, because that is actually the initial reason why I'm traveling to Asia, to just calm down a little bit, but you know, in a city like Hong Kong you cannot calm down, but that's okay. That was a spontaneous decision because uh, I wanted to fly directly from Manila to uh, Vietnam and uh, I have a flight, a connecting flight, but the, the layover is like eight hours. So I didn't feel like to, to hang around eight hours at the airport. So I thought, you know, the connections are great. There's an airport train that brings you like in 25 minutes from the Hong Kong airport to the to Hong Kong city here in the city center. So I, thought, I said, of course I'm gonna do that. So at least I have, I have seen Hong Kong because I was thinking to travel to Hong Kong for a few days but you know traveling is also connected with some costs and it all costs money and Hong Kong is not uh, cheap you know uh, accommodation is relatively expensive though the life itself is cheap you know you can you can make a great bargain especially with the food and stuff if you know where to eat and yeah so that's the latest update from my side so you know what's, what to expect. Um, I'm gonna send some videos from Vietnam as well. So I hope you enjoyed the videos I put up on YouTube. A little bit less commentary though, because I wanted to bring you the, the raw experience, the raw uh, impressions, you know. I want you to uh, experience as much as possible how it is to be there on the road in the Philippines or any other stuff I'm putting on. So this video, consider this an update now. Um, even it's a little bit windy I again forgot to put my mic on so I apologize for that hope you can hear me guys so all right yeah I'll be back with another update maybe in a week or two I don't know but videos I will put up for sure and yeah, I'm here in Hong Kong. I enjoy the rest of my time, the rest of my day. I have maybe a couple of more hours, so I should, should I will just uh, stroll around a bit. It's a nice weather today, blue sky, 
and yeah it's a perfect Sunday it's a perfect uh, perfect Hong Kong Hong Kong day a perfect uh, day to be in Hong Kong a perfect time to be off in Hong Kong and also to enjoy, enjoy the, the life a little bit especially what's going on on Sunday afternoons is uh, kind of really crazy because uh, here in Hong Kong you have like hundreds of thousands of uh, especially Indonesian and Filipina over the overseas workers and they have their only off day on a Sunday and they are all flooding the cities everywhere uh, you could see already some footage right? so I, am, I even haven't seen it in two years because I never came to this area actually hang out somewhere else but uh, yeah it was a pleasant surprise to see that also what's going on they, they really enjoy their time they're having a lot of fun and they enjoy themselves and that's how it's supposed to be right and this is what you should do you also should enjoy yourself and especially you should enjoy this video if you did so then uh, click the like button right uh, subscribe to my channel and you know the whole story right uh, i will continue to put videos up and uh, all right take care bye bye uh goodbye from hong kong and uh, soon from vietnam hello from vietnam bye bye